Originally called Navy Blue on its Japanese release, Battleship didn't see a release outside Japan until 1992, where it was repackaged to tie in with Mindscape's NES and Game Gear releases. This is a slimmer version of the board game, you place fewer vessels in a smaller 8x8 grid. At first, you not only have your single ship, but also other weapons depending on which ships you have remaining to you. A 2 and 3 rocket shot, as well as a 5 rocket shot in an X pattern, if you have your battleship remaining. There's also a radar that you can use to detect whether anything is hiding in a 2x2 two two square. You need to use these weapons early on. Quite often you can blanket a decent area that gives you vital clues as to the enemy's placements. Plus, you lose your ships, and you lose these weapons whether you used them or not. The game plays in a kind of campaign mode, in that you progress through 48 levels with a password system. Moving up the levels will increase the AI level, as well as giving you a greater variety of ships with sub-weapons, including aircraft carriers. The AI initially isn't the smartest, They'll often attack previously tried squares, or go for single squares when you've only got a two square ship left. However, it does increase pretty well, until you're at a stage where luck is your biggest asset. All told, this is a very cool attempt at replicating and enhancing the classic board game. The additions are enough to keep you playing the whole thing. The sound effects are spot on, using the whole scope of the sound chip to the fullest. And oh boy, that battle music is superb. It could have come from some turn-based strategy RPG like Shining Force or something. The little firing and sinking animations are solid. They look great on the little spinach screen. This really took me by surprise. I wasn't expecting to like this as much as I ended up doing. Get it, it's great. <laughs>